Hey guys, welcome back. Welcome if you're new. Today I have for you kind of like a, um, it's a tattoo video, you know, like explaining my tattoos, except it's gonna be super short. I almost felt like it doesn't make sense to make it, but then I was kind of like, yeah, cause like it's what you have up until now. And more than likely, if I do get others, there'll be videos about them. So I have three, four, if you count the one that I will tell the story about. Um, but yeah, so if you're interested in learning what tattoos I have and why, then just keep watching. <laughs> so my first tattoo, I'm gonna try to hide the crusty feet, but I don't know if you can see it right now. It's this open heart here on my foot. Um, and <laughs> that was my first tattoo when I was 19, I wanna say. Um, me and my sister decided to get the same one in Florida um, by my brother's tattoo artist, who's really dope uh yeah that's pretty much like the meaning behind it was just like our first tattoo we wanted something meaningful what's more meaningful than something matching your sister except and she'll say she didn't and blah 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 but she totally ruined it she ended up like it was supposed to be the whole open heart concept right so if you see on my foot there's like the longer side and then just kind of like a lighter smaller side and so like when we put our feet next to each other it was supposed to be you know the longer sides would match up to one bigger heart no, she decided she wanted it on the right foot too. <laughs> Not only that, but she got hers like upside down. Like, so mine points towards people, hers points towards herself. She just messed it all up. She just, it's early. But anywho, love you sis, but yeah. So that's the story behind that one. Then I have, <laughs> I'm like sweating trying to show y'all my feet, okay? And no judgment, please. Like they are crust nation right now. But this one I think is gonna be too hard to show. So, I don't know. I'll attempt to show you, and if not, you'll kinda just get to like hide my toes. But this is this one. It says, let go, let God. Um, as you can see, the God is kinda faded. I don't think you went deep enough in that part of my foot, cause you know that part's a little like rougher than the rest. Um, so yeah, it's kinda faded. Um, <laughs> I'm a baby, so like I never just went back to like try to get it like to get it retouched. I could have, but I just laziness, it's on my foot, it's not like I see it a ton. It's still my favorite. And um <laughs> uh I just say, you know, it's like the faded, like let go, let God, like I'm letting go, so it's like, you know, fading away. <laughs> yeah, so that's you know. That's that, okay, and so the last one, that was actually the last one I got. The two that I'm about to talk about are the two in between. Um, and so I left it for last because it's a longer story, but yeah. So I have this, I don't know what the best way to show it is because it's at an awkward angle, but this, uh, you know, black and white roses on my arm. Flex for you guys. <laughs> yeah, I have these black and white roses on my arm. There we go, that's a little better, right? Uh, that's what they look like and so the story behind these roses is basically they are a cover-up tattoo I've always wanted something like this but I was way too scared to get a tattoo this big so it's funny that I like even went through with it but it's a cover-up tattoo and what it's covering up I'm gonna zoom in I don't know how well it's gonna zoom but it's covering up this little section right here um, and basically the story behind that my little brother um, like went to jail for some time, my little brother got locked up. Uh, people who need to know why know why, nosy posies out there. <laughs> but um, yeah, so me and my sister were like, oh, like let's get matching tattoos for him. And so our original thought was like um, Lou, L-U and four, which was his football number. Um, and so that was what we originally went in, but then I was like, no, like, cause anytime anyone would like, you know, it, it, if he played football, he was number four. And so, you know, it was always like fours up. That's how he like tagged his pictures and all that stuff. Um, and so I was like, let's do hashtag fours up. And she was like, mm, not interested, but you can go with that. She's like, we don't necessarily have to get a matching. Like it's matching enough that like we're getting a tattoo for him. So I'm like, yeah, yeah, totally. Blah, blah. So I get the hashtag fours up. She gets Lou four. And then I worked in a group home for boys. And so when they would see my tattoos, they were making all these jokes, just like, we didn't know you were crit, da 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 da, all this weird stuff. And I was like, first of all, like, stop it. Y'all need to stop that. <laughs> but 
then I was just like, what are they talking about? Like, blah, blah, blah. And so basically, like, I'm like, what are you guys, like, Crips what? Like, who said I was a Crip, guys? When have I ever spoken of this? And so they're all like, you know, that's like fours, four point star, blah, blah, blah. And now I don't know exactly how accurate it is, but I'm pretty sure it's accurate because there are many different sources that were like, oh, yeah. Like, even when I got the cover up tattoo, there was a guy there that was like, yeah, yeah, I'm pretty sure they're, they're right about that. So basically, I was just kind of like, whoa, like, no thanks. Um, I don't want anything gang affiliated on me. I don't want any girls trying to come for me and beat me up or start beef with me thinking I'm something I'm not. So I was like, we need to get this covered up. <laughs> so I was like, oh, I'll do roses. Like, I always wanted those on my arm anyways. And so long story short, that's how we ended up with these beautiful roses, which, by the way, are awesome. Everywhere I go, people are obsessed with it. People, like, ask me where I got it. That's not me bragging because obviously it in my work but um obviously they did awesome because uh yeah um people love it and like i had actually when i did my foot the like tattoo artist that did my foot was like oh like can i show the others did it on he had like all the artists coming to look at it and, like where'd you get that done and um obviously i did my last one here in ohio and then the other ones were all in Florida. well that one was in florida and this one was in boston oh so kind of everywhere i've lived Cool, cool. Didn't even think about that, but that's pretty cool. <laughs> There's the linking story to all of them. But yeah, so I thought this would just be kind of a fun video to just sit down and make and talk about all my tattoos. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't cap on my tattoos. And the cover up, I mean, it wasn't that deep. I'm sure I could have left it on my arm and never really had any trouble, but I'm the type of person who doesn't like to take risks really. So we just went with that. But if you really look, you can kind of like see the force up still. So it's there in spirit, Luigi. I love you, brother. I love you. <laughs> but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed my stories. Um, like the video, comment down below any thoughts you might have. Subscribe to my channel and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye.